Hi, welcome back. I'm Celeste Kirby. I'm 37. I live in a retirement home because I have multiple sclerosis and fibromyalgia and they cause chronic fatigue and memory problems and so I can't hold down a job or remember which meds I need and be responsible for my own medications. So here I am. I have a lot of medical issues and I've been doing a what I wish people knew about whichever one I felt like doing. And I have done a depression one and this is a deeper than depression. This is what I wish people knew about suicidal depression. Because it's deeper than just depression, which in and of itself is horrible. There's passive suicidal ideation where you just think about it all the time. Like, I wish I would die tonight. I, You pray that you die in your sleep. You think about ways to off yourself. And then there's active when you actually try it. The main thing I want people to know about it is most people, okay, some people say they're suicidal just for attention or to be manipulative. If you leave me, I'm going to kill myself. Okay, that's an entirely different beast. I'm not talking about sociopaths. I'm talking about normal people who suffer severe depression. And they get so low, they really do think that they should go. Now here's the thing is, these people who are not sociopaths, okay? Not manipulative people. When they get that low, they honestly, truly think they're doing the world a favor by leaving. Honestly, truly. They're not being selfish. They're not taking the coward's way out. They honestly, truly think they're doing you a favor. You can tell them until they're, you're blue in the face that they're not and that you want them to stick around, but they don't believe you until they come out of that dark place that they're in mentally. But please, please don't tell them that they're selfish. Because that's like, oh great, I already suck, so let's just add one more thing I suck to on that list. Awesome. Please don't tell them that they're cowards. Again, they already think they suck. Please don't tell them it's just a phase. Please don't choose that moment to remind them that they are worthless and unlovable. That their mother hates them. That whatever. Please don't choose that moment to undermine what they are saying, to devalue what their emotions. Because when they open up to you, they are asking for help. They are saying, give me a reason to live. And again, they need to come out of that dark place. But if you choose that moment to remind them that they're worthless and unlovable, it may take years. They may never come out of that dark place. When they get that low, they honestly believe they're doing the world a favor. So please just love them.